you. Uh, life comp. Good afternoon. Uh, my name is Rich Lebowski. I'm the Vice President of Business Development for LifeCom. Uh, LifeCom is a mobile health and security solution provider. Uh, we're a joint venture between Hughes Telematics, uh, Qualcomm, and American Medical Alert Corporation. And um, Hughes Telematics in late July was acquired by Verizon. So now we are a majority on subsidiary of Verizon. Um, we are developing a mobile personal emergency response system. As you can see here, I've got the watch version of this solution. It's also available in a pendant and a belt clip, and essentially enables an individual to summon emergency assistance, either by manually pressing the display on the device, or uh, the system also has automatic fault detection capability through uh, sensors, a couple different sensors we use in the device, as well as a smart algorithm that we've developed. And in either case, whether the, the button is pushed or the device senses the fall, connects to an emergency response center over the Verizon Wireless Network, and then we have access to all 6,800 public safety answering points throughout the United States to dispatch the appropriate type of emergency assistance to the location of the device where. Uh, we use a couple different technologies to identify location, be it standard GPS, and we also use the network-assisted capabilities of the Verizon Wireless Network. I mentioned uh, mobility as a, as a prime value proposition. This is really geared at enabling independence for the user. Um, but we also focus heavily on caregiver services. So in addition to the device, the monthly subscription includes access to web applications both for the user and the caregiver. And in particular, the caregiver has the ability to get alerts sent to their cell phone on any network, any phone, or into their email account to essentially inform that family member caregiver of various events that could be taking place through, uh, um, you know, with the user that's wearing the device. Could be an inactivity alert, could be a um, overdue test call, a low battery alert. If the device senses an emergency or the individual pushes the button, those type of alerts can also be sent to the caregiver. As you know, there are about 65 million family member caregivers in the United States spending north of a couple thousand dollars a year to help support the ones they love. And we feel that providing a solution that would also help to lower the burden of care for that caregiver uh, is critical. Um, we are uh, located at booth 26421, and we'll be showing the various devices and aspects of our web applications. So please come by and see us if you can. Thanks very much.